We have bought into the illusion of disease like cancer, disease like diabetes mellitus, hyperglycemia, HIV, AIDS, sickle cell anemia. But we have bought into the word disease as this thing that we cannot reverse, as this thing that's just going to kill us. Disease, your body not being at ease is not killing you. What's killing you is suppressive therapy. Part of the allopathic community, these doctors are giving you chemical medicines that's killing you. The disease is not killing you. The symptoms are not killing you. The medicine that suppresses the symptom is killing you. But you're not eliminating, you're accumulating. So you cough it <coughs> to break up a glomulation. You're sneezing <laughs> to get all these foreign invaders outside of your body. You have a fever to literally bring circulation and oxygen and phytonutrients and minerals and amino acids back into the bloodstream to heal the body and get the body back whole. But instead, you think that these symptoms or diseases because they have lied to you and you have bought into this illusion, you go to the doctor and they give you their suppressive medicine therapy where they literally suppress the healing symptoms of your body. They suppress the detoxification mechanisms of your body and then you die. Runny nose, boils, tumors, cysts. Bumps on your face is the skin eliminating things from the blood. This is your body way of expressing symptoms by way of detox detoxification to get the things that's in the body out of the body arthritis or what you call inflammatory disease being inflamed which means something that's heating up is inflamed is on fire that's your body way of heating up the body for the elasticity of your cells and friction can move back and forth for you can astringe your things through your blood and through your lymphatic system a tumor what is a tumor a tumor is a glomulation of cells because the cells are too toxic to stay into circulation because it would change your pH balance and you would die. So what the tumor do, it tries to heal the body by clunking all these dead mutated cells together. A tumor, right? Now, could you have problems if the tumor is blocking certain blood pathways? Of course. Would you have problems if the tumor is blocking the duodenum of the stomach and you can't absorb your food? Of course. But don't forget the reason why your body created the tumor in the first place. You was already eating too much acidic foods and these things were building up into the lymphatic system. So instead of keeping it in circulation, the body agglomulated it. See, the body is trying to heal itself. You call it symptoms and what happens is the manifestation of these symptoms, the doctors call it disease and then they suppress the symptoms and then you die. To reverse these things, go on a fast, switch to an all fruit diet to help eliminate the rest of these things. Powerful alkaline herbs to help eliminate these things because the body must detoxify. Remember, digestion, absorption, utilization, and lastly but not least, which is these symptoms we're talking about, elimination. Whether it be mucus, whether it be uh, pathological entities, whether it be fungus, whether it be excessive uh, complex sugars, whether it be complex amino acids, any of those things. When it's leaving the body, you're gonna manifest symptoms. Quit running to the doctors when you manifest symptoms. My body's trying to eliminate, how about I help the body eliminate? Let me drink eliminating drinks, liquids. Let me eat eliminating food. Let me take eliminating herbs. That way I can get it out of my body instead of going to the doctor and have them suppress it in my body then i die of the suppressive therapy like everyone else you were born into bondage born into a prison that you cannot smell or taste or touch you have to see it for yourself you take the blue pill the story ends you wake up in your bed and believe whatever you want to believe you take the red pill you stay in wonderland and i show you how deep the rabbit hole goes